Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited for today's video. I recently picked up two of the new Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops and oh my goodness. Okay, so if you are not familiar with these, essentially they are liquid highlighters. There are also a couple bronzing shades within the line and you can mix them with a variety of your products. You can mix them with your primers, your foundations. You can apply them directly to your eyelids as an eyeshadow. You can pat them on the high points of your cheekbones or the other places of your face you would like to highlight. You guys, spoiler alert, I am so in love with these. So I picked up two shades. I seriously wanted all eight, but my wallet was just like, <laughs> no. These are not cheap. That's really my only complaint with these. They are $42 American and $52 Canadian. That is, that's a pricey item. Um, that being said, there are several different uses for these and you do get 0.5 flowing ounces. And I'm telling you guys, a little goes a very, very long way. So let me just show you guys swatches of the two colors that I got and then show you how I use them. So the first shade I got is called Celestial and this is kind of a cool tone with a little bit of a pinky hue. It is so, so pretty and you guys, oh my gosh, these are so, so beautiful. I've honestly never seen anything like these. I, I think this is the most beautiful makeup product I have ever seen. In real life it is just there's something about this that is so so stunning and then the other color I got is called moonlight and this is more of a true champagne shade oh you guys these are so so pretty you only need a teeny tiny bit and holy cow I mean look at that glow literally just lights up my hand right now this is so so pretty the first time I swatched these I think I just stared at my hand for like 15 minutes I was just like Honestly, have never seen anything like these. I do have the Becca um, Shimmering Skin Perfector Liquid, and I mean, it's pretty. I just feel like it blends into the skin in a much more natural way. That's it on the bottom. You don't quite get this intense, almost metallic look, which can be frightening. I mean, I realize this might not be for everybody, but when you apply this to your skin, you really have a lot of control. Like, they're called custom enhancers, and you really can customize the intensity of these. So like I said, there are a variety of ways that you can wear these and the way that I've been using them is I've been taking Celestial, which is the kind of cooler pinky tone shade, and I mix just one drop with my foundation. So I'll put my foundation on the back of my hand. I've been using Too Faced Born This Way lately, and I just take one single drop. The first time I did this, I was a little bit nervous. I thought like, oh my gosh, I could easily turn my foundation into like a metallic mess. <laughs> However, one drop just added a really nice, subtle and natural looking bit of luminosity to my foundation and I have been loving it. It's very subdued, but there is just that slight little bit of glow to my foundation and I love it. I've been using Moonlight as a straight up highlighter. So I've tried applying it to my cheeks a few different ways. I've tried a dampened um, beauty sponge, I've tried a brush, I've tried my fingers, and the way that I have found works best for me is just by using my fingers. Also, a little bit really does go a long way. The first day I used this, I put like a full drop on my cheek and I ended up blending it like everywhere and I had to wipe it off and start again. Less is definitely more with these, so all I've been doing is taking my finger and just gently dabbing it into the product right on the dropper and then just putting a couple dots on my cheekbone and then blending it out and then adding more as I feel necessary. A little bit really, like I said, goes a very long way and if you want a more intense glow, you can definitely build it up, but if you're into just more of a subtle glow, a little bit will give you just that and it is amazing. So like I said, I've been wearing these for the past couple days. I haven't had any issues with them wearing. They have stayed put on my cheeks all day long. I'd say like a full 10 hours of wear and my highlight is still very glowy and very much present. You guys, I cannot say enough good things about these. It has been a hot minute since I have fallen in love with the product as much as I've fallen in love with this. I purchased these myself. I would definitely consider purchasing more. I would probably wait until like the next VIB sale comes around at Sephora because like I said, these are definitely a pricey item. That is the downfall here. You really don't need much. You do get half a flowing ounce. I don't think I would go through this entire bottle in a year and that is how long um, they suggest keeping this product after you open it. So, I mean, if I use these products every day for a single year, yes, I think I would get my $52 worth Canadian. Um, 
And honestly, I think I may very well reach for these every day because once you start putting these on your face, I feel like it's really hard to reach for anything else because there's just something so beautiful and unique about these and I am completely in love. Anyways guys, so those are my thoughts on the new Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops. I am madly in love with these and I just love when I find a product that I can just go on and on about how wonderful they are. I mean, they're unique, they're multifunctional, they're super long wearing, and I just think they're so incredibly beautiful. So anyways, I love them. I'd love to know your thoughts on these. Let me know what shades you guys are loving, how you're using them. Please leave me a comment and let me know your thoughts. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch, guys. If you haven't subscribed, please go ahead and do so. Take care of each other, and I'll see you soon. Bye, guys.